guys wait let me turn the camera because i don't know who is let me turn no, it's easier for me to look like this i don't know who is making me sing i've actually shot some videos before this particular one but the way this one just happened that's why let me do my editing very how it's as thumbnail that's why i am making this video now and then when i started um this thing i started charging money people call me scan and everything it has not been easy and at the point i felt like quitting like, why would somebody come and call me scam like i made a video on was the episode when sha there's somebody in the uk that used to be like a friend sha like come well, what do you know about you to sponsorship this thing is coming this they shall say so many things and then me i was like hmm yeah in the uk does not mean you know more than me it was me that came here to tell you guys i am in nigeria i've never been to uk but i know how this thing works because i took my time to make my visa and everything even till the video i posted but even the video i posted yesterday everything has actually subdued you you know that before i started that video i gave people money i told them that if you come to my comment senior to say anything i am going to reply you back to back and i feel like that won't make them calm down and the one that auto love me make baby basic comment section we're going to check the comment i make sure that <laughs> I reply yeah. so if you come to insult me i'll insult you back i am a nigerian by default everybody's supposed to have defense mechanism so even if you call me scam be sure that you paid money and maybe after you paid i disappeared i blocked you and everything even as it stands now people actually paid money i'll tell them to call this this thing to confirm they'll say there's no need that they trust me that i cannot i said i beg i don't want trouble because it is after paying and i give the name of this care home and their website to call them to come that's when your order care becomes invalid whatever happens after that is me but even people that have called to confirm have i blocked them no we are still doing the application together i'm still doing cv for them and everything but just to be on a safe side that the order care you pay the 200 dollars is pay is for the care home once you call them and they say this thing I'm coming from Nigeria. Do you have a certificate of sponsorship? Once they say yes, my dear, your money has finished. So whatever I decide to do for you is for my heart. You get. So I have some applicants that I'm even begging to call. They are feeling me locked down because they feel like, just like um one of the applicants who have been, I've been doing our CV since yesterday. So I've been asking our question. I told her, I say, our CV we know they lie for year. I'll with whatever your experience, I'll put in your CV. But there's no how everybody has had that experience. So it's really been stressful asking that question and everything. I don't know. She, she is one of those applicants that actually sent him extra money. She sent him extra thank you. I never start work, oh. just normal consultation and everything. I never start work. She sent me extra 10,000 naira. And now if I had to call K home, she said she's not calling. She said she's busy. She said where she is is nice. I said, ha, have you forgotten that you paid me one hundred and twenty thousand? and Call this K home. What if I'm lying to you? She said she, she believed me. She said she trusts me. My dear, you don't even know where I stay. You don't even know where I live. You, 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 you don't even show if this is my real face. You say you trust. They said, I, I'm now. Now, now me they beg. Now me they beg applicant after paying that. Please call them. Please, now me they beg now. No, be them they beg me that please give us name of kid. Now me they beg them to please confirm. That's how it has really come to. And oh yes, I really want to appreciate every single one of you that actually trust me with your money, trust me with this process. That regardless of what people are saying, calling me a scam. That what's this one talking about and everything. You still find. I know you are part of you that is. Can you come BB Jave? Ah, no matter how somebody want to do motivational talking, the the Nigerian you will just happen. Ah, Jesus! Can you just move, move, please? Thank you. Eh, uh -huh. thank you. So as I was saying, your Jackie, yeah, to what entire. So I really want to thank every single one of you that you actually feel like you trust me. You know that when you want to buy something, and then many people in the comment section are calling you scam, thief only. If before you put your money, go you not if I say this again, a thief and everything. But most of it, the people still pay regardless. I still feel like, eh, if, if she has scam, she wants scammers. Maybe she's scammers now. They said, like, it really goes a very long way. A very, like, I really appreciate it, guys. I really appreciate And most of you are not even my old followers. Most of you just saw my video for the first time. I think you just say, send your account. I was like, what do you make you trust me? Is it because of how I talk? I go trust, trust person because of how they talk. How? But you guys still trust me. And if after paying, I'll send you the name of this kill. Call them to confirm if they 
if you request from Nigeria, you will say no, you trust me that I cannot lie. What if I'm lying? What if I'm using revised psychology for you? Some of you have even feeling reluctant. Now I'm the one begging you because if you don't call and maybe after sending CV and they don't say this, it will be as if I'm hoeing you money. You get it? so that's why I used to make sure that please call I beg. I know if you hope person money. So that once you call and they say yes, so I'm gonna say okay, that one can don't enter my pocket. Nothing way if you do a hair. But anything I do aside that I know that okay, I, I sit there for you, we sit there together, they apply together. You get it? so I really want to appreciate every single one of you i really want to thank you because it's not easy for people trusting you i open this channel it's not up to two months so for people trusting me with over 100 um, 100 and 100 and something thousand there and even my instagram page is is uh, my oldest picture is from february february sometime be january say february or january uh -huh. so it's not as if you know much about me i think you feel like ah, this guy i feel trust her like i cannot thank you and that's why to all of it that's why i'm trying my best for those of you that i've put you in that special whatsapp for now i told you guys i'm not creating good because everybody different people have different conditions some people have qualifications some people don't have experience some people. so i'm doing interview for single once you pay and add it to that website i'll just give you a number you go just did it so i'll be doing interview for you when it's time to do your cv i'll come and ask you eh, who don't seek for your family where we say you don't have pan boy water before i'll be this thing so now when you talk mm -hmm. i got used to address cv before so that during your interview you know what they cram anything for i tell you we know they come and me whatever cv i'm doing for is not like to just apply for the job i want you to get shortlisted like even after this job i want you to get shortlisted and even after shortlisted you're going for that interview and even after that interview you are getting the job because as i am i don't get sent to the apply many times for somebody you get so once they are shortlisting you like this we are picking interview dates after that after that interview you are getting this so the only thing that i know that we take time that you, you you're waiting for is your certificate or sponsorship check it now you guys understand what i'm saying so if, if i really want to make money from this i'll just be giving you random care home that you're not qualified from or just by letting you to apply with anyhow cv and that's what made me know that hmm, most of the thing that is happening in this thing gonna cv because i saw some people's cv and i'm like if, if even if i'm a repeater and they are even dashing me that cso you know if you see them with some people's cv it's not a cv quicking just that some people do not know how to arrange it and there are people that without a bag and there are some things that you will not put in the beginning of your cv you will shift it to the back there's some things you put forward some people with things you put in the middle like you just have to so you think those need like a whole reconstruction uh -huh. and there's some things that you just put inside so people wait on period so i want to thank every single one of you that have actually trusted me with your money and trusted me with this process that this girl she can actually do some things about it thank you so guys so so much thank you and so why i'm making this video is because somebody from uk somebody in uk she talked that she did uk like when i saw that email it was as if my eyes was blinking she said she's in uk that so She's bringing TV of her family members. So they are not actually like, um, maybe surname, sha, maybe blood, sha, maybe that's why she can't take them, of course, as dependent. So maybe cousin, brother, something. Hmm. She's bringing TV people. Can you guys see? Person where they UK. Somebody in UK, eh? She sent me an email, a eh, me, as she damaged that is in Nigeria, that you people have got this scam. Most of you are inside Isolo in Lagos. I've been called in Lagos. You are here. You are calling me a scam. Where was person where the UK? Eh? Person that lives that is in UK. He's telling me he's bringing TV people for me and paying. But I should give her this scam. TV people. Person where the UK? And you, you did inside Lagos. You did inside Ibadan. You did inside Oshun. Or you did inside Owewe. They call me scam. A person with the UK, they like, I just so that's why um, I came to make this video because it can't be like that. They use it because I, I don't know what really make you guys trust me this much. I don't know. And most of this bashing that I get is from people from UK. So even when my view, and that's why I told you, I don't delete comments. When you see anything, whether you say, eh, I am in UK, this thing is false, I'll reply you equally. And eh, it's false. I mean, I'll go ask you the evidence where you get. When last did you go on gov.uk to go and make inquiries? Since you are in UK, why can't you create your own YouTube channel? I'll come and bring in all this website. You cannot do any of this. Then, person will go do it, they call them scam. Which evidence do you have? Nothing. So that's why when they call me a scam like that, I'll just tell them, bring your evidence. You day you cannot me say you sabi pass me. So when she now she says me, well, if, I'm not even sure I'll be like that, but I don't screenshot them because that one, you know, it's just, it's just, I don't know if you understand. 
like you think Nigeria, Nigerians they call you scam. Hmm? But the country go where you they do this thing for person they bring in family member with the Nigeria. To come on, I don't even not even one person. She never say she never even say let me try one person. Mm -mm. She don't say let me try two. Mm -mm. She don't say let me. She's bringing TV people at a go. TV people, TV people. Even myself, I they fear for myself. I am scared. It's as if you people have one plan for me. I am scared for myself. TV people, TV people. And then you in Nigeria you're still calling me is come. know but thank you guys for those of you that has actually trusted me with this thank you so much um so um aside that um i have applicant that don't want to call that they just feel reluctant that okay this girl cannot lie and i have some that called and even after she called of course i first gave her the number after she called i sent her the website after i sent her i said please go and check the vacancy the vacancy date there yeah. she went there she screenshot it to me i just went and everything then after i checked the vacancy i asked her the number where i give you in tally with the one with the website before you come and say hey is my first number i gave you my name and agents can you say it was same can you now see mm -hmm. he said okay can you so now your are on don't finish we are done but your cv is inside the oval when it's time for your interview for your cv interview i will let you know she gets and they don't finish with that and everything but i never block her she's still on my whatsapp i'm still going to help her with the application process um and our cv i'll make sure it is like due process i will ask her questions make sure that it is what she experienced in real life so that during interview she will not come and be working head or come and be saying this thing because once they call you for interview by god's grace i want you to get this job i don't get time to be there you apply for person once they get you, yeah, you know, it's most of this CV. Like I told you, no employer will carry your CV and come and be asking you, um, why did you choose us? Why are you a carer? Why do you want to? No, no employer will do, do that. In a waiting day, your CV, they go take ask you question. Even if they will ask you, why, why did you want to be a support worker or this thing? They go first ask you that when you write, when you talk to you get for your CV. Everything they go ask you. But then you can't be somebody that you don't have experience and then maybe you're a lawyer. The first thing on your CV is now, um, I am a lawyer with BSc. I have fought for 52 children. Uh, I fight for their rights. Woman rights activists. Why do you consider woman rights activists with healthcare this thing? We don't need it. You move it down the CV. It is not relative to the job. Do you guys understand? So that's the mistake most people are making. And that's why I'm taking my time. So even when this um, person actually reached out to me that she has TV people that is coming, I told her that even that TV people, they cannot have the same CV. They cannot have the same website they cannot have the same key home because all of them they have um different qualifications different experience different this thing and even age group so i have to like talk to them personally ask them mm -hmm, who don't seek for your heights where you don't see before because these three people are not going to enter interview at the same time you get they will go they are going to and it's even different surname so they will go differently and i cannot be doing the same uh, copy and paste cv for everybody very soon now we go card they go not say ah, these people are coming so uh, that's why i'm using the words of your mouth even if it's somebody that you see that ah, somebody get my life this is how they do that's what i write in your cv so it's easy for you to answer your questions i know they like for cv we're going to use real life here. so i am just here making this video to thank every single one of you i am just here thank you and so far i have very very good applicants so far nobody is stressing me nobody is watching me and that's why i came and stayed that that hundred k that you pay though it's just for the care home. After the care home, we don't have any business together. But when I tell you we don't have any business together, it doesn't mean that that's it. But it's because I don't want people to feel entitled. But like maybe when I just say let me make I sleep some more, and a person go just call one finish my life. You don't pay me agency fee. You don't pay my application fee. The only thing you paid me for is for the care home. But I am ready to guide you to you get this job, even till you get your visa, even till you enter UK. So it's when you enter UK, you set it to your first visit. That's why I will now block you because we don't get business together again. You might, uh -huh. But I cannot just come and say, eh, the money will cover from Umak by Mekba. And I cannot do that. So when you understand that your hundred k has finished, wait for me. When is your time? I will attend to you. Just like since yesterday, I've been drafting just one CV because she doesn't have experience. And I'm asking her questions. So this particular applicant, she actually works. So when I send her a message, before she reply me, she go, when I attend to a normal people, which she did work to so i have to wait and I, I cannot rush her if i rush her mission will give me wrong information so whatever information i get from that's when i was sent to that cv company too they should do their final distance check then we will now send it to her and tell her to go through it and check for any mistake before we now do final um this thing before we now start applying for a job can you not see the step of everything we we'll go through so you think it's about still the 100k 
You think it's a boss still the Andre K? So when you come on here to call me a scam, just so that there's somebody in UK that just patronized me with three family members, with three this thing and everything. So to every one of you that trusted me, even without me saying much, this is me telling you thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much, thank you so much. I cannot thank you enough, and I'm sure by God's grace, we'll start giving testimony. But as most of you know, this process is not something that you start seeing results in one month, two months. Sometimes it takes three months, it takes four months, it takes five months. And I tell you, say, oh, let me see it. Don't see what CV. It takes one week. When you submit your CV, and that one week, that's two weeks. So before they even shortlist you, shortlisting is after they've closed the vacancy portal before they shortlist. So depending on where they advertise the vacancy, it could be two weeks, could be one month. So one month don't even go. Well, we never still see this thing. We never see this thing shortlisting. So for most of you that know this process, you know it's not something that. If I come here next week and come and say, oh guys, somebody just got the job and the person is in UK now and everything. Now nah, liar, they lie, give you. Now nah, liar, they lie, give you. So before you see improvement, before you see um um congratulations, this thing from people telling me, oh, somebody is in UK. You start from like five or six months. Because certificate of sponsorship gone last time before it come. You could know. This four months and so maybe I have a separate video that where I explain that. So if I come in next, you can come and say, So guys, somebody have gotten their job offer. I am lying to you, new. If I say guys, somebody uh, is in UK now. Then you see who when to when and you know this UK this thing now. I'll be so 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 if you know that you don't have trust issue and you feel like you can risk your hundred K with this girl, come and join the queue of C V people because the longer you wait, the more your waiting time. This thing can even take up to seven months. It takes people up to one month. If you have anybody in UK that went through this route, you can ask them. If you have nurse or doctor, ask them. It's not something that you, you do now, you get your job done, and you think in the next one you'll be in UK. My dear, it takes process. It takes due process. And that's why I cannot come out to tell people, uh, hey, your money will cover for this and everything. Hey, let me call me. I will attend to you based on how you came, based on your number. So, even if you're asking me a question, I'll first go and ask the first person that paid the money. I'll say, ma'am, do you have any issue? Do you have any problem? Mm -hmm. You say she no get. I'll go to number two applicants that paid. Do you have any issue? Do you have any problem? Any convenience? No, I don't have. I'll go to number TV. Like that. Before it now reach you, number 100. Mm -hmm. I'll go to satisfy them. Because those ones want to buy love you WhatsApp. If I don't reply, then you should not be like, ah, this girl. So you don't have to me and we're your first customer. I don't do like that. My old customers are my king. So you the people that is coming. Just raise yourself up. So before I apply, you go first reply. All I was say they don't do my WhatsApp and ask them, please any question, any doubt, any anything. Do you need me for anything? Use me now. I am here. Use me as you like. But they say no question, no anything. Okay. Before I move forward, come and reply you that you're just joining us. So I hope with this few point of mind, I've been able to in a way to appreciate you. And thank every one of you for being one of Ashidemi's brand and everything. So for those of you that ask me on WhatsApp, you know that guys, it's not easy. I never sleep well since yesterday. I just see the even step is ah in the next day this guy you will this I say it's a lie. See the way because I be but when you get your CV, you see that some way parts, the summary parts, the skill and the experience it was drafted by me. When you're that thing, education and anything that one will consign me. But you see that some we skill and experience. Let me draft them. Let me type them. But the only thing is the company just sent me to correct the English. You know, say me, I know to serve English. So you see. So now, before, I did not even know that I would be partaking in this CVT. I just feel like I'll just send it to the guy. But I don't want him to go and be all this government. So I'll start charging more for CV now because the work I'm doing. Ha! Ah, if you know how many diseases I've gone on Google to go and read, dementia paralysis and um, this one cancer all those things this thing that i don't even have to read it sit down break it down into what a care worker is supposed to do and it's not easy it's not and then somebody will come here and come and call me a scam come here come and call me a scam. you that your name is scam that your cv yeah go and use to apply so if they they did the in the in the google session they go and use to apply and now that a youth person reached out to me to actually apply with a family members. My fee just increased by ten thousand. Mm -hmm. So now your money is one hundred and ten thousand naira. Yeah, one hundred and ten thousand naira. Because you were here when I was shouting since last week. Come and apply, but no, 
You say, say, you say, I be scam, I be winch, I be this one, I be that one. Mm -hmm. So now, where I don't get international applicants, my money just increased by 10,000. So, if you're actually coming to join this sweet family, your money is 110,000. I don't know how much that will be for dollars, maybe like 105 or 100. I don't know. Get 200, I don't know. Your money is actually 110,000. So, the more you wait, so if you feel like Next month or next two months, you you will come and apply my day. Oh my, at at if I want five hundred k right there, because now we with the way God, did. that's why I told you that. Yeah, it was my experience, it was my innovation, but I know that God give me this vision. I know that God, no, but I, I did not go and learn. I know, I know that God, I know that God. So even before next week, my money fee don't enter three hundred k. You can't expect that the more price that I say now, you my money is increasing. And for for uh, CV. Before I was charging 20k and everything, but I didn't know that I'll be partaking in that CV like this. I just feel like the company will write it, I'll just review it and everything. But I did partake, it'd be like saying it's just that I should even learn how to drive the CV here because since if I can write the summary, the life experience, and everything, wait till you remain again for CV, wait till you remain. So if I can just draft all those things and like this thing, so the more you wait, the more my money increases. I feel they prepare you for body. Go and call your body. So people will be saying they don't pay. They don't pay be that. And if you're coming newly, just hold your one hundred and ten thousand naira. <laughs> that ten thousand naira is doubting fee. Don't even tell me that you did not see this video. It does not concern you. Hold your one hundred and ten thousand naira. And okay, five thousand naira is doubting fee. And five thousand naira is because I have an international applicant. You get multi this thing. In fact, it should be one twenty. Oh, no verse. Now one twenty. Now one hundred and twenty thousand. So hundred k. Yeah, one hundred and twenty thousand. So ten k is for doubting me, thinking I'm a scam. That's why I don't come and pay. Are you there yet since? So ten k is because say hey, I don't get international applicants. Are you? My just is a whole board. You see, ah, make a no verse. Say damn me, I should damn me. It's no verse, no verse, no verse. My just is a whole board. You get. You know, say when person not they get customer now. Yo, I got our guy. Now they pray say me I don't want this before. They pray me I don't want this. I'll put it sooner. <laughs> it also move. <laughs> so now, if I see somebody from New Zealand or Germany that contact me, I swear money went to one fifty k. The more I expand, and depending on if I count how many applicants I have now, what what you want? I swear my money they increase, and by the time the first person gets. To UK, hey, hey, hey. if you don't have your five hundred k, don't even contact me. By the time the next person enter UK, ah, well, one million. Don't buy ten for where yeah. Don't don't buy ten million. Then, my dear, is it big build dome? Yes, that's a, that's how business works. You 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 go. The more you get more customers, the more you charge. So is the 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 business is never up to two days old. It's never up to three days, and I've just. Increased my money by twenty thousand naira, and then for CV because I don't know how I go the draft CV. That CV for now, sha ah, that CV they stress me because the one where I see, see as I put away from my, I'm having a headache. This is where person never hear before. That CV, sha anyway, depending on how you should maybe like thirty k or forty k, I don't know. So the more you wait, the more your money they increase. <laughs> you know, so don't think you come and chat me up in TV more it's like this guy see the chest run, no, or work and. What I've been charging more again is because I know I'll be with you during this application process, guiding you and all of that you get. So <laughs> it's not easy. It's not easy. And I know people can ask ridiculous questions and everything. But even my WhatsApp number is not visible. My phone is on don't disturb. But so far I have very good applicants. I have very, very good applicants. So any message just send me. If I don't reply, I just gonna say this guy bed, just leave me, I just sleep. And you say you you know reply, I pay to you, excuse you. Did all this money is it part of it? Your money finished when you confirm this thing, but please, I don't want you to get to that. I don't want to. If you send me a message, if I don't reply, and that's why I have to WhatsApp the first one. The this thing is on don't read, you can't know if I reply. This second one, you can actually read, you can actually is on read recipe. You know if I read your message or not, you know if I'm avoiding you or not. You get <laughs> and that's why I left it open. Usually, I don't need to leave it open so that somebody will know when I'm ignoring or anything. So if you send a message and you say it's no tick blue, no say this girl no siam. Is it that she's sleeping or she, it's not easy? But if you use code to disturb me, what well, I will like not send your CV. I will give you CV, CV engineering CV to go and apply for healthcare assistant. Uh -huh. So no use call. I don't normally go, I don't even like calls. So 
to just leave it but so far i've been a, i have good applicant so i'm only just increase bar Twenty thousand, ten thousand for having international applicants, and ten thousand for doubting fee, for doubting me and being. And then to some of you that you sent a message that you wanted to pay and everything, and then you disappeared. When you're coming back, just come back with two hundred and fifty thousand naira. You get, you see, because you're, you're even the worst of everybody. Now you worst pass. After telling you sent your account number, and you can't disappear. As you want to send money. You are sending me one hundred and fifty thousand naira. If you cannot send, just leave her. You know, I'm not the rich people. In fact, the applicant that I have got to to even attend to them. I'm begging God for time. You get if you don't have it, just leave it. T for things. There's no way you come to my dear. I come and say, ah, oh, please now, can you come? They have this interest and everything. <laughs> please, if I have family, I have family. Please, I have family. I have fifteen children. 17 grandfather and 19 grandmother. I will take feed them. You know how much I'm paying for this rent? Do you know how much I'm paying? You know, there's no light in Nigeria, but we have light in our estate. Do you know how much I'm paying? I will go take pay my house rent. If please, 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 oh dear. I thought it was oh dear. Oh dear, should be also okay. So, guys, that's what I said. It should be just making them. So, guys, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I can't pay. For people that have left comments like oh i'm so disappointed why are you charging for it or you're i don't know why people are actually turning up this is it because your favorite youtubers did not post few websites this week she <laughs> actually this is the scalp she i have this scam i have this scam let me be the thief i be the oyoshi why are people coming now oh Thank you guys so much i cannot thank you enough thank you so much for trusting this brand and so guys i mean i see the draft cv like this i can't wait i don't know once i'm done with drafting the cv everything um once i'm done with drafting the cv everything will be easy for me because it will just remain application now that cv they take that now that's the one that is dream and of course that's the most important thing out of everything your cv and cover letter CV and cover letter, that's the most important thing. So after that one, I don't say ah, before I say let me finish one. Somebody don't send an email. Before I say let me finish one, person don't send the email. But thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you God. Thank you for the Thank you God. Thank you guys. Thank you so much. So for those of you that has actually called the care home and they say yes they offer you see your jk when is nobody that let's see there's one i'm working that is to say in front of this house that's how i'm going to eat here yeah. don't come back to me anything though you're wearing all the dove head here yeah. don't come back to me and just please behave yourself in the google because i'm looking for how i'm going to block people so that in case they ask why is you block and i'll say eh and it's because when i chatted that she, she told me k instead of okay mm -hmm. i'm looking for a reason to block you so be careful, be polite. <laughs> so if I chat to you, I do not reply me immediately. I'll block you if they ask me, say, hey, I attack the person, it's not reply. Even if it's 0.1 seconds, I'm looking for a visit to block you. I have too many applicants to apply to, so I didn't find who go vest me. But so far, nobody won't vest me. <laughs> so that's like, so far, I really had good applicants. And I'm not always happy, even that I mean, there are mothers, there are people that is old enough to be my mother, and the reason my for me, it's a room 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 for